He's awfully difficult, Frank Rizzo, to sum up in a word. Uh, if I had to do it in a series of sound bites, word or, or word plus included would be funny. That might be at the top of my list. I mean, he was one hell of a storyteller. He was one hell of a joke teller. And for a year of my life, for, for literally every single day of 1987, I was in his presence for hours on end. And it was a blast, you know, to be at that age and in the midst of a campaign like that and to enjoy his company. Uh, there were four of us in the car for a year. Steve Silvetta was the driver. Mayor Rizzo would sit shotgun. Marty Weinberg was behind the driver. I later figured out why, because Rizzo pushed his chair all the way back, so I was the guy who sat behind the mayor. And to drive the city limits with him, where he had a story about every single intersection and things that had happened and people that he'd met, it was the time of my life. So funny, engaging, storyteller at, at the top of the list. Um, he was a leader. I mean, he, he loved being a leader and he loved being in that commanding role. Uh, he was immaculate about his appearance and his grooming. And there are a whole host of funny stories about that because, you know, he had an opinion about everything. He had opinions about everything in life, frankly, whether he had a reservoir of knowledge about those things, and even if he didn't.